What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Operative Fitness, a.k.a. Hashtag Gains! And today is going to be a little bit different of an episode of Honest Reviews. Now, I don't know about y'all, but I watch, uh, I watch Vegan Gains because sometimes he has some good material, and I like to troll his shit sometimes. Um, I like to see what he's got to say. Um... You know what I'm saying? I don't want to be vegan whatsoever. What's I mean? Look at these gains I've made from. I mean, look at that. Look at the gains I've made from fucking eating way shit. You know what I'm saying? Why the fuck would I want to go vegan? You know what I'm saying? So I'm throwing that out there right now. So don't get no fucking vegan shit going on. But I wanted to try this shit. Beyond chicken, chicken strips. See that? Beyond Chicken, or uh, Beyond Meat, Beyond Chicken, Grilled Strips. Now, that looks exactly like Chicken Strips, and I see all the fucking time Vegan Gains talking about goddamn, uh, there's so many alternatives, and they all taste exactly like fucking chicken. They all taste like meat. Motherfucker, if they tasted exactly like it, maybe people would consider it. So, I want to fucking see if it tastes like it or not, or if it's doable. Like I said, I'm not going vegan. Even, even if it tastes like 100% exactly like grilled chicken, I'm not going vegan. For one, this fucker was five bucks. Five bucks for uh, nine ounces. So that right there is out of the question. But let's just go over the macros real quick. You got three ounces, which is about six strips. is 120 calories, three grams of fat, five grams of carbs, two grams of fiber, and 20 grams of protein. So the macros are pretty lean, but not as good as fucking chicken. So right off the bat... Right off the bat, no. Now this shit is basically made with uh, soy protein isolate and pea protein and then chicken flavoring and all kinds of other fucking shit that's for vegans. So I'm going to heat this bitch up. Y'all stay tuned and I'm going to give you my honest fucking review on this shit. Alright, so I just open this shit up. Kind of looks like chicken. Let's see what happens here. Oh shit, way too many. Kind of looks like chicken. Alright, I'm going to heat this shit up in the microwave. Look at that. Vegan gains in there. That's some vegan gains right there. It actually smells... It doesn't smell too bad. I can smell that bitch cooking. Alright, pull these bitches out. It kind of looked like chicken. A little bit. Alright, I'm gonna give this bitch a try. See what happens. Alright, the moment of truth. Man, it's fucking light. There we go. The moment of truth. Hey, man. That ain't bad. It's kind of rubbery. It's a little rubbery, but the texture is pretty, pretty close to chicken. I ain't gonna lie. You can even, you can even feel like the fibers. I was just chewing it, but there is a little bit of like rubbery taste, or not rubbery taste, but rubbery uh, feel as you're chewing it. So the texture is kind of close, but it's not 100 percent as far as the texture. The smell and the taste. It's not bad. It's pretty fucking close to chicken. I ain't gonna lie to you. It's not that fucking bad. I'm gonna start doing a different scale rating too. As far as taste. I'm gonna give it like a fucking eight and a half. Overall, for it trying to be like a chicken, I'm gonna be I'm gonna give it like an eight and a half. Solid eight and a half. It's pretty fucking decent. Don't get me wrong, I would never fucking substitute this shit for chicken because for one, it's the macros are different. For two, it's expensive. For three, I mean, I just don't see myself doing it. I do like it. I do suggest it. If you are considered trying vegan shit, 
maybe you want to mix it up with real fucking meat here and there and you want to throw this shit in you know for a week and do like <clears throat> you know vegan meat for a little while test it out maybe mix it up I do suggest it it doesn't taste bad at all it is a good alternative um, I'm actually very surprised with it strongly suggest it give it an eight and a half overall versus texture and uh, taste and all that and that's gonna be pretty much it hope you guys like this review and uh, that's gonna be pretty much it thanks for the support let me know what you want to see next and if you don't like it to fucking bed subscribe share like it comment below scroll but don't troll and don't hate me cuz I'm fucking swole but it ain't from that vegan meat I'll tell you that right now and check you guys later